Okay. Now we're almost ready to talk to you, Gaston. We just have to do everything else possible first. See, is that the gold? Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, he's trying to flex. Hey, Gaston. Uh -huh. oh, so thirsty. Yeah, you look thirsty. <laughs> they should have went with something else. Uh, ah. You. Giant tanker of water. Come over here. What is he talking about? You're severely drew high. <laughs> You're severely dehydrated. I'm not a tankard. I'm a person. The sun has shriveled you like a raisin. Yeah. No. No. Not my intimidating muscles. You take that back. Relax, okay? My name's Miss Skullcrusher. I'm here to help you. You're real, huh? You're real? <laughs> Wait, I don't need help. You need my help. And I'll only help for water or jewels. That strange mirage wizard needs a jewel. Oh, that's, uh, Jafar. Jewel. Gaston. I'm looking for something called a jewel of time. Do you know where it is? <laughs> no. Or maybe I can't recall. But I do know the answer lies at the bottom of a cold, refreshing drink. Gaston, I know you're thirsty, and I'm going to help you with that. But I need your help, too. All of Attorney Isle is at stake. You need to snap out of it. Mm -hmm. Snap? Snap peas? Oh, I didn't even eat a vegetable right now. Oh, no. Well, now I almost feel sorry for the guy. Vegetables? How long have you been out here? Wow, this is worse than I thought. I need answers. Oh, I'm going to be stern with Gaston. I need answers. <gasps> Can't talk. Too parched. I'm wasting away. If only I had some of those green spiky leaves. <sighs> you know, the ones tastier than a cactus and just as full of water. Aloe? I have no idea what you're talking about, Gaston. Ah. Oh, and to finish off the meal... One of those flexing spider-like creatures that live in quicksand and some light brown sweet raisin things? Okay, clearly I need to help you first if I'm to have any hope of finding the Jewel of Time. I'll be back with the food you asked for. Just hang on. He has another one? Oh, I already have everything. Okay. He's just going to... Eat the scorpion raw? Well, I guess it's Gaston. Agava, scorpion, and dates. Here you go. No trouble at all. Look at him. Hmm. There, is that better? Got your strength back? I've never lost my strength, Miss Skull Crusher. Don't be ridiculous. Let's agree to disagree. You can't even admit you're thirsty. Let's arm wrestle. Ha, ha. I'd crush you like a bug. <gasps> now, what are you doing here in Gastonia? Excuse me? <laughs> yes, where do you think you're standing? In the glittering dunes? <sighs> Harley, this is Gastonia, and I'm the ruler. <sighs> I've been here for quite some time, so I decided it should have a proper name. You know, something I came up with? What are you doing here? Hmm. Well... I'd done all I wanted in my village, hunted all the trophies, impressed all the townspeople. There were no more feats of daring I could do to gain their accolades. Okay. Oh no, that's terrible. Ooh, I'm sensing there might be a girl involved. Exactly. I'm looking for the Jewel of Time. Have you seen any magical looking gems around Gastonia? <laughs> No, but I'm always looking for treasure. Lots of it. I can make use of. You. No, actually, I... <laughs> do you have experience as a lackey? Gaston, I'm dealing with something pretty important here. 
Eternity Isle is at risk. If I can't find the other jewels of time, the whole island will be destroyed. Ah. Hmm. That doesn't seem bad, but it is really worse than me. Gaston, being without someone to sing my praises and do my bidding. Gaston, ridiculous. If the Isles destroy, no one sings anyone's praises. You have no perspective. I think you're dealing with sunstroke. Okay. Do you want to feed into his ego, though? What in the world? Oh, that is a problem then. You need a hero to fix this for you. Huh. Fine, I'll do it. You're a hero? Uh, what's your plan, hero? I'll lead the way. We'll begin at my encampment, the capital of Gastonia. You're not... Uh, you know what? Lead the way. I'll follow you to your encampment. What in the world? What is with this neighborhood? I don't know. Oh, where are we going? Oh. He literally just has like a little shipwreck tent. Okay. Here we are, the capital of Gastonia. This dude is delusional. <laughs> Great, can we please focus now? What are you doing here in Glittering Dunes or Gastonia? Well, if you were familiar with heroism, you know that heroes always go on quest. Oh, I'm quite familiar with quest. Sure, go on. Anyways, back home, whenever I was out doing heroic deeds, my lackey, LeFou, was always by my side. Lackey? This LeFou? It's LeFou, right? LeFou sounds more like your sidekick. Mm. Sidekick LeFou can be bothersome, but I've never felt the need to kick him in the side. That might hurt my toe. That's funny. No, no, a sidekick is like... A friend that helps you out with stuff they tend to be smaller and very emotionally involved with your success <laughs> oh then lefau is that lefou my sidekick i like it and now you can play that part for me on my quest oh okay what quest is that i think i have hero potential how about you be my sidekick <gasps> you just said a sidekick is smaller than the hero and you're much smaller than me oh yeah yeah wow you actually put something together with logic. Good one. <sighs> Impressive, I know. Everything about me is. Back on task, what quest were you on? My quest for the Mirage Wizard. <gasps> Have you met him? Carries a snake-headed staff, uses too many long words, a little see-through. Oh, you're talking about Jafar. Is that his name? Mirage Wizard is better. That's, <sighs> it's true, Mirage Wizard is better. I started seeing him after I established Gastonia. He asked that I find something called the Jewel of Time for him. Of course, I never work for free. <laughs> so he said this Jewel of Time was hidden inside a vault filled with treasures and that I could have all but that jewel. So the Jewel of Time is in that vault. I wish Jafar had told me about this. This is actually helpful. How do we get into the vault? Uh, how do we get into the vault? There's one problem. We must find the key to the vault first, and the key refuses to be found anywhere. Maybe we should check everywhere you looked again. Retrace your steps. Two pairs of eyes are better than one. Hmm. I'm thinking... <gasps> I know. We'll retrace my steps. You can start by checking around this camp while I rest. Ugh. You. I. Fine. I'll take a look around and see if I can find anything unusual. He's just ridiculous. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's in your chest? I'm about to steal your stash. Ooh, what is that? Dun, dun, dun. Oh, here's another journal. Oh, some coconuts. Let's see. 
I'm so bored. I even would read a book, I think. Poor Gaston. Is that what I was supposed to get? The coconuts? The Forgotten is somewhere nearby. Ooh. Ah, oh, that's her paint. Oh, my inventory is full. Eat. I found Rapunzel's paint. And another journal entry. Oh, really? No, a memory. Oh, looks like I'm stuck. Nobody conquers nature like me. With some, be fine on my own. Ay, ay, ay. All right, now what? Paint palette, homemade glue, coconut husk. Gaston. What are we gonna do with this? Gaston, I found some stuff around your encampment while you were napping. Yeah. Nap? Naps are for children. <laughs> I had a mighty and much deserved rest. That's funny. Whatever floats your boat. Ah. No, I leave making boats float to the shipwrights. Dude. While you were resting, I didn't find the vault key, but I found these. Hmm. Oh, that? Those are from... I have no idea what those are. Never seen them before. Kind of sounds like they're yours. <laughs> what? I, uh, don't be ridiculous. I don't play with craft items. I hunt and do other things requiring immense strength. True, I can see you doing arts and crafts. <laughs> I can't see you doing arts and crafts. Why the coconuts? <sighs> Why not coconuts? Now, we should search my shipwreck next. Your what? <laughs> shipwreck. Ages ago, I left my home and took to the high seas in search of adventure. Ah. But my ship was blown off course during a storm and got caught in a massive tidal wave. <sighs> Thanks to my natural nautical talents and impressive physique, I survived. The wave pushed my vessel far inland to the strange desert. Mm -hmm. I've been ruling it ever since. Okay. I'm sorry, Gaston. It must be really rough to be stuck here. Good thing I came over when I did. No, no. I was going to free myself right before you appeared and helped. Mm -hmm. My shipwreck is in the wa the waste, but I can't get through those blasted time <gasps> rifts. They suddenly showed up and got in my way. I can handle those time rifts. Leave it to me. I'll just need to get some more mist for my hourglass. <laughs> Fine, you go handle that and I'll meet you there when you open the way. All right. All right. Okay, this shipwreck looks pretty cool. That's pretty epic. All right, Gasty. What's going on? <laughs> oh, he looks so sad. Hmm. No sign of the vault key? Well, we tried. I say, we Did return you know to the capital of Gastonia. You can write a song about me. Okay. We need that key. The isle is in danger. You don't deserve a song for failing. Shane. You don't deserve a song for failing. <laughs> me, fail. Me, fail. We're changing tactics. Old hunting strategy. We stay still, and the prey comes to you. The prey is a key. I don't see that strategy working. Ah. Hmm. What if there is no key, and we're already doomed? You never mentioned it with a scarab key. <gasps> oh, what does it matter what the key looks like? We'll never find it. Gaston, man. We've looked in two places. Two. Haven't we done enough? Not really. If you care so much, keep searching. Search the waste. Check the quicksand. You'll see I'm right. <laughs> You've clearly not as skilled as me, but go ahead. Try and be the hero. I'll wait. I actually like Gaston. Ooh, double hole. Let's see. We gotta fish out the key. We can go ahead and get some of these fish at the same time. Skeleton. These fish, uh, fishing holes are popping up a lot faster than the ones back in the valley. What is this? Is this the key or is this a fishy? Oh my god! That is so cute! It's a Lafu key. It also looks like a little teddy bear. 
Or it's not a key, the key, is it? Gaston. Here is almost as good as playtime. What is this? Do you want to give these? Uh, Gaston, is this the foo? I um. Oh, I was wondering where I left that. It's like a Wilson type moment. Wilson, you were lonely out here. One word, why? No, nah, you were lonely out here. Yeah. Me, lonely, never. <laughs> I made this lefo to pass the time. Nothing more. Thought it was an improvement on the original. Mm hmm. Recreating your sidekick seems like a I'm thing a lonely speak. person would do. <gasps> Miss Skullcrusher. If I had been feeling lonely, wouldn't making a lefo out of coconuts and talking to it every day make me more lonely? Yeah, that's giving Major Castaway Wilson vibes, for real. No, a coconut lefou would have helped you? Actually, that does make sense. Honestly, when it comes to you, I have no idea. Uh, no, a coconut lefou would have helped you? <laughs> Hardly. It didn't help at all, and I feel as marvelous as ever. Yes, you're clearly doing great out here. Well, I'm going back to my encampment. That quicksand damaged lefou's paint. Aw, oh, his paint. Whoa, you can't be serious. What about the Jewel of Time? The Jewel the Wizard made up, which can only be found with a vault key that likely doesn't exist. Proceed without me? I've been thinking, even if there was treasure to be had, what does it matter? There's nothing here to spend it on. No one to impress. This guy. Ugh. If you won't help me directly, can you at least tell me a little more about the Scarab key you mentioned? Ah. <sighs> Fine. The Mirage Wizard said it's in two pieces shaped like a scarab, and when you put the pieces together, it will lead you to the vault. And were you able to find any clues about it? <laughs> All I found is sand and the occasional piece of junk. <laughs> oh, and a chunk of odd metal bug. Isn't that the key? A metal bug like a scarab? Ah! No. <laughs> Gaston. Describe for me what you think a scarab is. You know, a scarab, long, hollow thing you store a sword in? Scabbard, Gaston. That's called a scabbard, not a scarab. A scarab is a desert beetle, just like the metal one you found. That can't be right. I assure you that it is. Never mind. I assure you that it is. You go hang out with your, uh, coconut lefou. I'll handle this. Ha! Fine. By the way, I threw the bug somewhere in the plains. Probably in one of the time thingies. How does he know the word thingy? But since you got through those time rifts, I'm sure you'll find it. Yeah, don't worry. I've got the right tool for this. My hourglass should help me find it. Now this is a great day to play outside. All right. It's in the plains, he said? Is that a place that I already have? Yay. Let's see. Oh, the plains is just the regular area. Okay. Wait, what is... Oh, that's just a plant. Alright, let's see if we can find this scarab. Hey, right. I bet your first friend was a toy. Am I right? Hey, Buzz. Talk to Jafar at the hologram station. Okay, so I guess I found it. Oh, there it is. Scarab piece. Alright, the hologram was around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Alright, Jafar. Uh -huh. I see that you have acquired one half of the scarab. Your scarab? Were you watching me? Yep, only had to deal with the socially starved Gaston for a while. Hmm. I see that you have acquired one half of my scarab. You're scared of? Were you watching me? 
Yep. Only had to deal with a socially starved Gaston for a while. You're Scarab? Yes. I did create it after all. I commend you on your progress, Miss Skullcrusher. There may be a reason to hope we will avert catastrophe after all. And why didn't you tell me that the Jewel of Time was in some secret vault full of treasure? Ooh, is that the Cave of Wonders? Perhaps I wanted to test your metal? Though, I had hoped Gaston would have done most of the work for you, and it would be as simple as taking the Scarab Key from him. I charged Gaston with the task some time ago, and clearly the fool made no progress. Honestly, I think he was too lonely to be productive. He created his friend out of coconuts. Hmm. Hmm. Coconuts? Yeah. We found it while we were searching for the scarab piece. I think it's kind of sweet, actually. Is it possible that now, with company, he will be of greater service? I doubt it. The second half of the scarab remains to be found, and Gaston may be of help to you yet. Do you limit your search to the glittering dunes? After all, the lush jungle to the east used to be a desert. All right, I'll check back in with Gaston and get back to my search. All right. Hey, Gasty. Uh, check in with Gaston and LeFou. That's funny. I'm assuming he's back at his little area. Let's go see. Hey, Gaston. What you doing? Hey. How's it going, Gaston? Hmm. I want to make sure you have one thing straight. Coconut LeFou is not some kind of companion or toy. I made him simply to pass the time. Okay. Like someone would do with a toy? Don't be absurd. I'm a grown man. Toys are for children. Never feel ashamed of having fun with toys. You were in a tough situation. No shame. It's kind of adorable, actually. It's kind of adorable, actually. It's not. Ugh. Why do I even bother? Why do you care what I think of Coconut LeFou anyway? Ha! I don't. I only care what I think. But when I got back to my encampment, it became far too clear. Mm. I've strayed from the Gastonia path. <sighs> it's time for me to take up my impressive pursuits again and stop whittling like some pitiful carpenter. I must move forward. Did you find the scarab? Scarab, Gaston. And yes, I did. The other word sounds scarab. I don't know. Very similar. I can understand why he made the mistake. One half down. <laughs> Excellent. I'm that much closer to boundless treasure. Do you want to move forward by helping me find the other piece of the scarab? Hmm. Not now. I need to do rugged and manly things for a, for a while first. Dare I ask what that entails? Huh? Oh, you know, the usual staring out into the distance from a peak. Testing my metal against the forces of nature. That sort of thing. Good. Luck, I guess. Perhaps as I gaze stoically at the landscape, I'll catch sight of the other scarab piece. Maybe. Alright, I'll check back in I'll check back in with you in a few hours. I guess I can explore a little in the meantime and see what secrets Eternity Isle might have. It'll have to do. The wander of the dunes. Okay, Gaston. I already started another quest. Give Gaston some time. Okay. To recenter himself. Look at him. He's not gazing into the distance. He's literally gazing at a wall. Okay. All right. Let's carry on exploring. Oh. Okay. Oh. Yes. Gaston is ready. Finally. Alright, well, let's go check on Gaston for sure. Where he at? Where he at? Where he at? Where he at? There he go. There he go. Alright, let's go. Let's go see what Gasty's talking about. How long was that? An hour? Was that like an hour? Alright. 
Let's go find Mr. Gaston. I'm gonna pick this up. Boop. Because we need everything we can get. That one's stuck behind a tree. All right, Gaston. What's going on? Hey. Hey, Gaston. Did you do your rugged contemplation of nature? How are you feeling? <sighs> I made a habit of ignoring all talk of feelings. <sighs> Did you find the next piece of the scarab? Not yet. Any chance you got leads on the next half of the scarab pee? Jafar said it might be in the wild tangle. <laughs> the Mirage Reserve may be right. I've been over every inch of the dunes, and I haven't found the other half. Okay. <gasps> I have a thought. I once spotted a blonde girl dashing around the wild tangle. All right. She's right there. You mean her? Queen of the capybara? Maybe the jungle girl can help. Okay. Oh, you mean Rapunzel? Is that her name? The one time I saw her, she took one look at Coconut and LeFou and dashed off. All right. I don't blame her. I'll head to see her next then. I'll come with you. You'll need someone charming like me to deal with people for you. Oh, um, not sure if that's such a great idea. What? Why not? Actually, I have something else only you can do. I bet I'll find the other scarab piece soon, and then we'll be off to the vault. We'll need some adventuring supplies. Can you pack some food and drink for us? I need you to talk to Jafar and get a hint of what awaits us in the cave. All right, talk to Jafar. We'll need some adventuring supplies. Hmm. We'll need some adventuring supplies. How about that? <sighs> You're right. I am an expert on adventuring. I'll get the old explorer's pack going. Awesome. That's what I like to hear, Gaston. No one prepares for adventures like Gaston. <laughs> Great. I'll check back after I talk with Rapunzel in the Wild Tangle. Hey, Rapunzel. Did you hear that? <laughs> Hello. It's so great to see you. Is there something I can help you with? Yes, I'm looking for a magical item. It may have been in the wild tangle for some time now. Oh, uh, what sort of item? Could oh. it be part of one of my hobby projects? Half of a scarab made of brass or a similar metal. I don't think I've ever found anything like that. But there is one spot <laughs> in the grove. Mm. I always hear the buzzing of lots of insects coming from there, but it's been blocked off for a long time. And scarabs are bugs, right? Maybe it means something. No, I hate bugs. A clue, a clue. <gasps> How exciting. You really are solving a mystery. <laughs> I guess I'll go check it out. Hmm. I'm so curious now. Please let me know what you find. Sure, I can take some photos for you. That way you can see for yourself. Good luck. Thanks. After we found the Jewel of Time together, I'm sure this will be no problem. All right, y'all. I have found the swarming insects because I was literally like, what the heck is that? So I know where it is. And now I know what's going to happen with it, I guess. Where is it? It's right here. Find the swarming insects. Take a picture. Let's see. Oh, yes. It's starting to rain. Hey, Rapunzel, can you come get in this picture? Come here. She's so cute. But I need you to be on this side with Goldie. Okay. Yay! Look at us solving a mystery. Yeah. That's her pose. That's Oh. That is so cute. You see how she opened her eyes to peek to see if we're if we've taken the picture yet? That is so cute. I love that. <laughs> Adorable. Oh, she's floating. Let's do the silly capybara pose. Look at us. Queens of the capybara. Aww. Goldie is a little cutie. <laughs> Those poses are silly. Do the really smiley one again. Yay. Okay. I think that's enough pictures. All right, Rapunzel. Uh -huh. Did you have any luck with the search? Yeah, actually, we're standing right in front of it. It's creepy. 
Did you well, find practically everyone's hero here? I know, Mo. Well, I found this strange looking pedestal that was just swarming with bugs. Here, I took some pictures. Oh, let me see. Oh. Oh. <gasps> the swarm looks like it's all scarabs. It's odd that they're here in the jungle. They normally stay in the desert. Oh. You're very smart, Rapunzel. Huh? And it's also odd that they're swarming like that. I wonder if the magic of your scarab key has called them here away from the desert. Hmm. Could be. How can I deal with this? The swarm is too thick to get through mm. right now. Ugh. Have you ever heard about carnivorous plants? Yes, I have. Ah, I see what you're suggesting. This valley is the most amazing place I've ever seen. Ah, I see what you're suggesting. <gasps> I knew you would. Yay! Ah, she's adorable. Ah. There are lots of carnivorous plants around here. There's the Venus flytrap and the pitcher plant. <gasps> If you gather enough of them, you can make some carnivorous flower arrangements. Mm. That sounds cute. Then if you place them by the pedestal, I'm sure they'll take care of the scarab swarm. Amazing. Thank you, Rapunzel. Come on, Goldie. We need some green fly traps. Do we not have green fly traps? I'm pretty sure we do. Oh, is everything else in my inventory? No. All right. I guess we got to find some green fly traps. I'm pretty sure I've gotten green fly traps. I know they're down in the first part of the tangle before you come up here with Rapunzel. Oh, that's how I keep getting garlic. There's garlic up here? Okay. I was like, why do I keep getting garlic? I can't. Okay, there we go. Is this what you want? Spindle? Oh, is that another shiny one? Okay, I'll give it to you anyways. Hi! You're important to me. Oh yes. Almost level seven. Little oh. cutie. Oh. Alright, let's find these green ones. I know I've had them. Maybe I gave them all to Mickey? I don't know. But I know I had some. For sure. Let's just check. And this won't, that dot won't go away. Eternity Isles. Forging. Oh yeah, I've literally cut all the plants. The grasslands and the promenade. All right, let's just keep looking for more. There's one. Let's just be very thorough around here. I'm like, I'm pretty sure I've already collected enough, but there's one. Oh, that's not green, though. Oh, there's one back there. Cute. All right. I'm really surprised that I don't have them. Remember, even playtime can't quite recover. Uh, because of the rain. That's funny. There's another tree. Oh, oh. Ah, oh, Rapunzel. <laughs> it's okay, you're still cute. But I'm trying to get these almonds. Man. Oh, well. Ooh, I didn't even realize the castle is right there. Okay. Here we go. Let's see. Ooh, a chest. Ooh, is there any clothing in here? Is it actual clothing? I thought it was a clothing chest. Alright, alright. Looking for the fly traps. Looking for the fly traps. 
All right, let's keep going. Maybe we have some over here because it looks like, oh, yes. There we go. There we go. All right. Craft some carnivorous floral arrangements. All right, let's go back to our house. I love the rain. This hey, valley Belle. is the most amazing place I've ever seen. It is. It's the most amazing place I've ever seen. Ooh. That's funny. It's a Gaston item. Okay. How many do I need? We'll just start with one. Oh, I need two. All right. There we go. All right, and two of those. Very good. This cute little monkey back there. All right, and now we need to decorate using them near the bugs. I was going to say, is it going to work if I just put them right here? That'd be silly, though. Oop. We'll put them where it says. Where did that creepy thing go? There it is. I'm actually going to stay back in case there's an actual cutaway. I highly doubt it. But it would be cool. One. Two. All right. Near the bugs. It's not close enough. Okay. I gotcha. There. There. All right. Is that close enough for you? Check on Gaston and see how he's doing. All right. Gaston. I should move the well closer to his thing, but he'll be out soon. Causing havoc. Okay. Let's go. Wait a minute. Alright, let's go see him. Oops. You don't need a water. It's literally raining. What am I doing? Okay, oh. Alright. Let's go and see what Gaspy's talking about. Gaston. Gaston. Oh. Did I feed that snake? I think I did. You're making so many dreams. Wrong way. Sorry, I'm new in town. Hey, Gaston. How you doing, Gasty? Mm. Very well. I'm returning to Gastonia path. Okay. That's great. I don't exactly get it, but yay for you. <laughs> That's mm. great. It is, isn't it? Mm. Now, I just need you to find the Mirage Wizard's vault and get me that treasure. How goes the hunt? I'm getting him a treasure now? I'm working on it. I nearly have the next piece of the Scarab Key. Rapunzel has been a big help so far. Did you finish your part of our adventure prep? Of course I did. <laughs> but I did it my way. I don't need adventuring supplies when I can scale a cliff with my bare hands. Is that true? <laughs> I prepared with 500 push-ups. All right. So when you said you'd help, you just did the opposite. Hardly. I did help. I stopped us from taking unnecessary supplies. Ugh, I guess wait here and I'll come grab you when I've got both pieces of the key. Pointless. The plant should have eaten the insects. Return. All right, let's get back to the grove. Looks like Buzz is over there supervising. All right. Oh, there they go. Oh, look at that. Ooh. There it is. I'm going to actually move these now. So that I can get a better look at it. Alright. 
All right, Rapunzel. Look at that. Nice. Ooh. The scarab piece is completely rusted. Maybe Jafar would know how to restore it. Talk to Jafar. All right. Is there a hologram station around here somewhere? I don't know. Let's go ahead and go back to the dunes. Because I have a feeling they're going to try to send me back over there anyways to get Gasty. And I know there's one right here. <laughs> I see that my plan progresses nicely. You have attained the second piece of the scarab. Isn't it our plan? Yeah, full steam ahead. No thanks to you. I feel like something nefarious might be happening. I don't know if it's so smart to be so chummy with Javar. Isn't it our plan? <laughs> ha ha ha. What a quaint misinterpretation. Wow, rude. Anyways, we've run into a problem. This piece of the scarab looks super beat up. The tangle has really done a number on it. I don't think it can fit together with the other pieces as is. <sighs> yes, that does pose difficulties. Mm -hmm. Perhaps some um, temporal magic will put it right? I don't know. Are you able to access a time-bending table, dream shards, and a source of mist? Yep. I imagine that by using the impressive powers you have cultivated, you can return the scarab piece to its prior state. Hmm, worth a shot. Here, take these schematics and put them to use. All right. Fancy. Great. I await word of your success. All right. Let's go back to my crafting table. But, but, but. Pretty. All right. Hey, little monkey guy. Examine. Sweet. What did that do? Repair the jungle scarab piece at the time bending table. Quest. Ooh. Repair. I do like the animation. All right. Talk to Jafar at the hologram station about the next step. Well, everyone here be since we're here, we'll just go to the one down here. Where was it? Here we go. Finally, my plan has reached fruition. Is it a little ominous that it's like storming when this is happening? I don't know. Mm -hmm. The jewel of time is nearly in our grasp. Mm. We are very close to putting right all that threatens eternity isles. I got this. You're welcome. I feel like I did all the work. Mm -hmm. I do. You cannot be more wrong. After all, I have guided your every move. Mm -hmm. However, before you venture forth, it is important that I pass along the following information. Only a diamond in the rough may enter my vault. I already had this conversation. I am a diamond in the rough. What does that even mean? Poor Gaston. <laughs> Poor Gaston. Do not let his disappointment distract you. I won't. I don't care. Jafar, I'll be able to get in, right? Oh, false modesty does not become you. That is funny. I know I'll get in. Let's see, can I block her? There. Touch the two pieces of the scarab key together and it will lead you to my vault. Okay. That's quite the security system. The jewel of time is priceless. I must keep it protected. All right, I'll tell guests on the bad news and be off. The wild tangle swarm complete. It's me, Miss Goldcrusher. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.